Capricorns, welcome to my channel. My name is Sally and this is going to be your love reading for the remaining days of August 2021. This is going to be a collective energy from all those born under the zodiac sign of Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising. Only take what applies to your situation and leave the rest for others. If you're new here, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome. So Capricorn from Earth Magic, you have purification, you have power, you have um, completion and rebirth. So I see Capricorn, some of you are closing off karmic cycles here. There is a lot of healing going on in your environment. Some of you are letting go of toxic and negative energy from your life. I see deep, intense healing going on with you guys, Capricorn. You're closing off cycles here. You're letting go of codependency. I see uh, a brown new person in you, Capricorn. Like you're not the person that you used to be period to this time. I feel like for some of you, like I said before, you could be letting go of codependency. And when it comes to someone, you're codependent on someone and um, their energy. I see you letting go of that. And it's all about new beginning for you guys, Capricorn. Let's see what's in the rest of your cards. We have the Fool. We have the Ace of Cups. We have the Four of Sword. We have the Page of Wands. We have the Nine of Sword. The Page of Cups. The Moon. The Eight of Pentacles. The Nine of Wands. The Ten of Pentacles. The Ten of Sword. And the king of cups at the top of your deck we have the page of pentacles okay capricorn for the signs that you might be connecting to here we have water sign we have air sign we have eight sign and fire sign capricorn i see you taking a leap of faith on the situation here you're kind of letting go of whatever that's happened in the past year and you are looking forward to a new beginning this is like a fresh start for some of you here I see a love opportunity here for you guys. Someone will be making you their love offer. This person is deeply in love with you here. Mm -hmm. I see this person reaching out to you here, Capricorn. I feel like for some of you, there is no communication between you and someone here. And I feel things have ended between you and this person. Mm. I see someone here wanting to be with you in a committed relationship here. But I see some of you are unsure of someone. I feel like for some of you, someone from your past would be showing back in in your life this person will be showing back into your life you'll be coming back but i see you you're not very sure of this person this person has brought about a lot of disappointment and i feel like and when it comes to this person you are not so certain here so i feel like some of you you're not going to be paying attention to this person it's not going to be used business as usual between you and this person here but i see someone here that is willing to work on this relationship with you for some of you, this is someone that you have just recently met. Or this, is, or this could be someone that has been in your life for a while here. I see good news here in regards to you and this person's relationship. This person is deeply in love with you, Capricorn. I see change coming towards your direction here, Capricorn. Let's try right to get more insight. Why is the fool here for Capricorn, Holy Spirit? They love reading for the remaining days of August. We have the Queen of Cups. Yes, someone wants to be with you, Capricorn. They want to take they want to take a leap of faith on this relationship and i feel like you are feeling the same way too capricorn you do want to give this person a chance here but i feel like some of you have been through so much here that you are having a hard time opening up um completely letting your guard down with this relationship but you're thinking of you know moving forward here let's see why is the ace of cups here for capricorn holy spirit for some of you you have not met this person yet so moving towards the uh, September, I feel like you're going to be meeting this person. For some of you that have not met this new person yet. But I also feel the energy of past person here surrounding you. This person will want to come back. But I don't see you. Some of you, you're done for good with this person. And I see you moving forward, looking forward to a new beginning. So I feel like the relationship between you and past person, whatever cycle the both of you have been through, it has helped you grow into the person that you've become now. It has helped you, you know, set boundaries and know what you want when it comes to your love life. Why is the Ace of Cups here for Capricorn? We have the Hangman here. Someone is tough on your energy, Capricorn. I feel for some of you here, there's someone that is obsessed with you. This person wants to be with you badly. They do. I'm getting strong water sign energy here for some of you. This person wants to be with you. Hmm. 
Why is the four of sword here for Capricorn Holy Spirit? I'm getting the energy of celebration here. I don't know. I'm feeling that. Capricorn, I feel like there's going to be a reason for you to celebrate really soon when it comes to your love life. Because I'm seeing forward movement here. And I feel you're not allowing anything to you're not allowing anything to hold you back. I feel um despite the fact that you are not completely open, you are still, you know, looking forward to this new beginning here. Why is the fourth sword here for Capricorn? We have the ace of sword here. I see communication coming in here, Capricorn. If this is not communication for some of you, I feel this is you gaining clarity on a situation here. You're beginning to understand why some certain things happened. You're beginning to understand why this person acted the way they acted towards you here. I feel like this full moon here is going to bring about um, some kind of um, clarity into your situation. You're going to be very clear. Things are going to be clear to you why um, it happened the way it happened. Mm. Let's see, why is the page of wands here for Capricorn Holy Spirit? We have the lovers here. I feel for some of you, this could be a soulmate that you will be dealing with here. Mm -hmm. This person would be a soulmate for you guys, Capricorn. Why is the Nine of Swords here for Capricorn Holy Spirit? Let's see. We have the Queen of Swords here. Someone is thinking about you. Someone is very restless about you, Capricorn. Hmm. I feel for some of you, you have blocked this person. You are no longer interested in this person. I also see someone here that is very interested in you. This person is deeply in love with you. They love you. And they want the both of you to be um, together, Capricorn. Let's see. Why is the Page of Cups here for Capricorn, Holy Spirit? We have the Five of Pentacles. Someone is not very happy here, Capricorn. This could be your energy. Hmm. What is happening here, Capricorn? Some of you are still looking back at the past here. Some of you are not completely healed from past situation here. So I feel uh, a little bit of sadness in your energy, Capricorn. You're being withdrawn here. Why is the moon here for Capricorn, Holy Spirit? Why is the moon here? Okay. We have the Three of Cups here. We have the Hermit here. And uh, the Hierophant. Hmm. Okay, Capricorn, I feel like some of you are going to be finding out um, secrets about past person. For some of you that are not aware, um, your past person was married. Um, if they told you that they were living that relationship uh, or they have left, they lied. They are still very, very much married here in this situation. Hmm. Tarot, um, if you're going back to past person, you have to be careful because I'm seeing a third party um, situation thing going on here. If you don't want to involve yourself in that, then I feel like um, this is something you should think about very well. Why is the Eight of Pentacles here for Tarot Holy Spirit? We have the High Priestess here. Tarot, uh, before investing in a love situation, before putting your effort into a love situation, I feel like you need to think about it very well. Like I said before, you need to allow your intuition guide you. Why is the nine of wands here for Taurus? Holy, oh, sorry for Capricorn. Some of you could be dealing with the Taurus. I don't know why. That. I see someone here having anxiety. This person is heavily worried about you here. This person is looking forward to reaching out to you, or they are waiting for you to reach out here to them. They are concerned about you. Why is the ten of pentacles here for Capricorn? We have the six of cups here. There's someone here that is missing you. Someone is seeing you as a soulmate and Capricorn and they want to have a family with you. Mm. Some of you are not emotionally ready despite the fact that you're looking forward, um, you're prepping to move forward. You're not here emotionally ready. We have a firm prince here. I see someone here feeling disappointed in the situation between you and them here. Capricorn, let's see. Hmm. I see an opportunity for a new beginning here. This could be with um past or old person and past or new person here. Someone is keeping an eye on you here, Capricorn. I feel like someone is feeling like they are losing you. Mm -hmm. And I see this person rushing back in here. They feel like they are losing you. And I see them rushing back in with communication here. Hmm. 
Africa, I feel like some of you have been waiting for this um reconciliation, this reunion with past person. Mm. I see, I see a change here. Someone is still very into you. They are. But I see this person is not very stable in their environment here. Um, a lot of confusion in their energy here. Okay. I see ah, communication and forward movement here. I see someone here not very satisfied here. This person is going back and forth here. I see you and someone getting things off the ground here. Something stable here for you guys, Capricorn. All right, Capricorn, this is all I have for you. If you like this type of reading, do not forget to like. Do not forget to leave a comment to let me know how you feel about this video. And um, do not forget to hit the subscription button. Uh, I've said that before. Do not forget to hit the notification bell. And if you want to book a personal reading with me as this is a general reading, information to do that will be in the description box. Thank you guys for your love and support, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.